back to my channel so today is a very much requested video uh, I'm gonna basically do what's kind of in my bag what fits in this beautiful bag this is the Louis Vuitton Capucines BB so many of you asked me to actually do what fits inside this handbag after I unboxed it a few weeks ago so obviously I have been using this a ton you guys so um, this one and also my um, my tote my um, Chloe tote that I recently <laughs> unboxed as well I've been kind of switching back and forth but most of the time I carry this handbag um, I even took this with me yesterday like to oil change you know like the least flattering place to go you know but I was like going with the style you know why not so anyway um I'm just gonna show you exactly what I have what I have been carrying for the past few weeks the normally stuff that I do carry these days and then I'm gonna show you also what you know the different things what will fit inside and so on so I think the best way to do it you guys is just to Here's, by the way, the little overview. It's just to kind of put the camera down so this way I don't have to hold it up and you can see it much better. I'm just gonna tell you one thing before um, I'm gonna show you the inside. The one thing that struck me the most that I didn't really expect it about this handbag or when I was purchasing, I had a different idea. I really thought that all I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna carry it just like so, you know, uh, by this handle and I kind of, took the strap even off because I knew I'm not gonna need it and how surprised I actually got because I have been using this crossbody strap like crazy and this is just something that I am gonna attach this now so you can see and this is just something that I haven't really expect myself to be using uh, I just thought you know I'm just gonna put the strap at home it's just gonna stay and I at first I was just carrying in my handbag but believe it or not if you just put the strap in the handbag it does take some space so I thought I'm just gonna leave it home but then at some point I just attached this you know to the handbag and I was like I need this strap in my life so believe it or not like I ran to you know like the oil change yesterday I went to church so obviously I was holding you know like this it was more kind of elegant but then I you know I went to grocery <laughs> shopping and do different things and I didn't want to change my handbag which normally I would and you know and this strap comes so handy and it's so comfortable crossbody I'm actually shocked truly you guys I'm shocked how comfortable this handbag and this crossbody this size you know i have it on the longest setting by the way that sits beautifully it's just like perfect length for me and i think it's great so yeah so let me put the camera down and i'm gonna show you guys what i have inside and what it can fit all right guys so here's my handbag you know what let me just remove this this might be a little bit easier to <laughs> show you okay so i'm gonna show you what I have in this handbag right now and that's pretty much what I carry what are you gonna see in here so um here's a little overview it's a little bit messy so I apologize so as you can see in this like a second kind of compartment which is in the back I usually put my um my wallet and the wallet that I'm carrying right now is this Chanel I would say this is like a medium um, medium size wallet um, see if I compare to let's say like a Louis Vuitton Clemence do you see how much longer it is but we'll see if this one will fit I didn't even try um, this is the Sarah wallet so also it's much bigger so I just want you to kind of know that this is like I think they call it a compact this is like a medium kind of a size wallet so this obviously fits there perfectly with no problem I just have to you know you kind of go like this and just put it right there so um, yeah so the wallet would be sitting in there I don't have anything in the zipper compartment it's completely empty there's nothing in there but I assume you can always put some you know if you have some cash or something okay and then in the front compartment I have my cell phone then I have my keys this is the six ring keys I have some Kleenex I have a lipstick and by the way this is the lipstick that I'm wearing uh, Rouge Dior 625 it's beautiful you guys I talk about this in my recent favorites so yeah this is a great lipstick so I love this lipstick 
And then what else do I have? I have this Chanel card holder right here. So I have some extra cards in here. And then this is just a receipt. I want to change my oil yesterday. And uh, there's a little hand sanitizer that probably shouldn't be here loose. And I have a little uh, hair tie just in case I need. So that's pretty much it, you guys. So um, obviously I could still put like sunglasses in here. This will still fit in. But that's pretty much what I carry on regular days. I don't really carry with me <laughs> like a cosmetic cage, cosmetic case. But I brought these, so you can just kind of check if any of these will fit. And obviously, if you have a smaller wallet, let's say, or if you just carry the, you know, the, the card holder, that would be awesome. But if you have a smaller wallet, let's say like this, or the Zippy coin purse, obviously you can see how much smaller it is, so it will certainly fit. Um, and then obviously I have my OKs with some extra cards in here, so we can also see how this will fit so yeah let's start with this maybe because i'm curious if any of the full size wallets actually will fit so i don't know visually it looks for me like the front pocket is a little bit bigger but let's just see okay so there we go the front pocket fits with no problem it does take pretty much like well there's a little room but almost takes the full length of the handbag let me see if i can put it in the back in here yeah, it does fit. Yeah, but it seems like the back is either a little bit tighter or a little bit smaller. I don't know. Um, but it does fit, so that's a, that's a nice surprise. So it's good, you know, if I have to carry a bigger wallet, <laughs> I don't have to, you know, kind of switch wallets downsize. And I assume Sarah wallet will fit as well. Yeah, so that's a good plus. That's a plus, you guys, because the same with my uh, V-Toad. Uh, I can uh, fit the full size wallet with no problem and these are pretty much like very similar size so that's a plus so I am very pleasantly surprised so let's see if I put this again in here because most of the time I carry this I kind of retired my Sarah to be honest with you it's you know it's it's beautiful wallet I love this wallet and it's it's like so special but I haven't been really using it for in a while but uh, it's such an old wallet, but it looks like it's brand new. <laughs> Look how clean it is. I'm always amazed. The quality of this wallet is amazing. So anyway, um, I have my Clemens wallet in here. And if you do carry some cosmetics, which honestly these days I really don't. Um, I do have some like a Gucci compact in here. The things that I would normally see what I do, I just put it kind of, you know, on a side. Um, this is uh, Jo Malone. Here's a little hand sanitizer. You know, just look another lipstick in there. Just little things that, you know, we would normally have. So this mini pochette will fit in here very, very easily. Let's see if I put it this way. Yeah, you can even fit like this. See? That's awesome. And then you can, you know, if you need a card holder, this will probably still fit in the back. And then obviously I need my keys. Let me put this one straight down. I obviously need my keys and I need my cell phone. We'll go in here. So look at this. It's perfect. I didn't even expect that. <laughs> I can still put my Kleenex in here or, I don't know, sunglasses on top. And then you can just close and, and just go. You're good to go. This is actually... I'm actually surprised. <laughs> this little handbag fits a ton. So obviously, let me put all of these. I also have this... Chanel, which they are pretty comparable. I did a video like ages ago. <laughs> but let me put all that stuff in here and see if we can, if this is going to fit or feel the same. Is this it? Okay. So let me put this. So it feels pretty much the same as the mini pochette. Okay, let's see. I still have my phone in here. You know what? This one feels a little tighter. Maybe it's a slightly bigger, but still fits. Do you see how it's nicely um, lays down in here? It still fits. So, yeah, if you really need to carry a cosmetic case, you can certainly, you can certainly fit in. Because you know, as you can see, and with the full size wallet. So imagine if you don't have a full size wallet and you have maybe one of those little wallets, then you have even more space. See, I still have my card holder in here. I can put it like that and then maybe you can I have some extra cards in here maybe you can put look at this I can put it vertically see how nicely it will fit 
and you can still close it and be good to go yeah i mean look at this it does get a little heavy i'm not gonna lie with all that stuff so typically as you saw like i would not carry all that stuff I, I it's just too much okay like first of all i would not carry this if i want a lipstick like you saw it in my first i'll just kind of you know just put it in there and uh you know yes i do carry a wallet and i always have some kind of like extra slg just to have some extra cards so i either have this or i have a little you know um card holder if i don't have a full size wallet i will use any of these you know kind of um smaller slgs and obviously i always have my phone and i always have my keys so that's just something that just has to stay and uh yeah i think it's really nice i didn't even bother ever to close this but i guess i could there we go so it's just gonna keep i guess the shape a little bit better if you put this little <laughs> this little uh, toggle here in the middle but i never did <laughs> that was the first time okay so yeah so as you can see this handbag can fit quite a bit it's it's the same it's quite surprising but this is the same kind of idea as my vetoed bb that i have and it it's really for a small bag that it is it can fit a ton in my opinion so yeah i think this was quite a surprise how much i can actually fit in there so yeah love it so i hope this video was helpful i hope i answered all of your questions this bag so far is amazing i love it and like i said it's truly comparable size wise to the vetoed bb and that vetoed i feel like even fits more because the veto doesn't have that middle you know divider that middle compartment so you can really put a tons of stuff in the uh, veto this one you know because it has those two compartments you know you have to kind of arrange things around i don't think you need any um like an organizer or anything i think organizer would just take way too much space for this particular handbag i don't think it's needed because of that middle compartment you already have some kind of a organization and yeah i think this bag is enough if you carry your everyday essentials and like i do you know I mean, obviously if you go to work and you have to carry a laptop you just need a tote <laughs> you know something or separate bag but this is just such a nice it could be daytime bag it could be evening bag so far so good and you know i love the color the color is just so neutral and i it's just great you know it does can can get a little heavy i'm not gonna lie if you start stuffing things in it you know but like i said like for mine everyday essential it's just perfect you know and most of the time i just keep this flap inside in here and uh yeah i really have been loving and i told you guys about this trap earlier <sighs> this trap is just amazing okay so Yes, I don't know how it's with different sizes. I thought they discontinued the PM size. Let me know if that's true. Uh, because even on the LV website, all you can see is the um, the BB size or the, what's this called? Yeah, the BB size. And then um, the PM size is nowhere to be found. But um, this is a perfect size bag. I'm very happy that I pulled the trigger and I finally got it. This is going to be my very much, you know, kind of more fancy, elegant bag. But at the same time, I feel like it can be great and casual because of that crossbody strap. And like you saw, it fits a ton. I love it. I have so far no complaint. I will do the upgrade uh, update. <laughs> I'll do the update in a couple of months or maybe a year just to tell you how it's going. And, uh, you know, what are my thoughts? Um, I still do have a stickers, by the way, <laughs> on this thing. So I'm still not taking it, you know, uh, as, as long as it's sitting by itself nicely, I'm not going to touch it. So anyway. All right, guys, uh, don't forget to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up if you like this um, video. Let me know if there's anything else would you like me to do. I know there was a few requests for different videos, um, so I'll be slowly, uh, you know, making those as well. And uh, yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.